morning, everyone. Today is officially October 1st, which means this is gonna be the first day of Vlogtober. So it's finally here, my favorite month, and I guess I'll just film my life and hopefully you guys will find that interesting. So I will just keep, keep doing it if you like it. I wanted to like turn on some of these lights, so I'll make it all spooky and cozy in here. Put these out here a couple of days ago because I felt like I wanted to have just a little something extra. Let's put these ones on on the staircase. Where is it? And then it has this feature where it looks like flashes too. Ooh, just regular. <laughs> And then I have some here, so let's put these on. Okay. Now we have that all spooky. Yay! I picked up some cider donuts today from a place near my house that I love. And I think I've tried so many. I'm like, this is my favorite one, the Adams one. Really, really good. I found these at Walgreens too, these like Halloween press on nails and I really love that company and press. So I'm gonna be putting these on soon. And then we're gonna be making chili. So I'll take you guys along. I think today we're gonna to make chili cause it's a cozy, cool day. So we'll make some chili together. We'll watch some scary movies. Try to keep it as festive as possible <laughs> at all times. Okay, we got some mail I wanted to open up with you guys because I'm pretty sure this is a very festive situation right here. Okay. I'm sure I waited a long time for this to come from China. <laughs> it is! Oh my god, I forgot I got this! It's a ghosty sweater! I can't remember what color I ordered. Did I order the purple or did I order the orange? I don't remember. But it was from Amazon and it's like a knockoff of the ones from, um, what's it called? Mod Posh that are like $100 and I feel like I don't want to spend it. So I just got this. Oh my gosh. It's so cute and it's thick too. It's like heavy. I thought I had shoulder pads. <laughs> it's thick. Oh my God, it's so festive. Yay, I can put this with like a skirt. I was thinking maybe a skirt because I just ordered like a maroon skirt and a tan skirt. So maybe a tan one, tan corduroy. Yay, I love it. Cute. Okay. garbage. Okay, I can't really show you this, but this is a perfect example of asking you, ask the universe and it will, what's that word? Manifest itself. I literally just said, I was like, oh, I just need a little more money because I'm going on a trip because we're going on a trip. I'm taking you guys. We're going to go to Lenox, Massachusetts. And I will post that when we get back. So you'll probably end up seeing that right around the same time that it's coming out when this comes out. And I just got a, because I switched insurances, medical, medical insurance, and I just got a refund from one of my, my payments. Like this is, I really believe when you put good out there, you ask the universe it hears you, like it's listening. You can make it happen, manifest, say it. Say positive things. Say, like if you say the negative, it tends to go that way, you know? This is TED Talks with Catherine. <laughs> okay, random little soapbox moment over. Okay, Ugh. now since it's rainy, I like to watch a little ghost hunters or something spooky, just like light. 
in the background while I cook. We're gonna do, is it Hulu? No, it's Amazon Prime, I think. Nope, I just pressed Creepshow. Creepshow is good too though, have you seen that? That's actually pretty good. It's kind of like, like gross, it's kind of gross, but it's still good. Okay, just whatever this is. Oh my God, have you seen this? Hold on, go back one sec. Have you seen that, the Blackwell Ghost? It is actually kind of terrifying. If you like paranormal -like activity or things like that, you, you'll really like that. It actually scared me and I don't normally get scared. I'm just gonna do ghost hunters for now and just keep that on. I like keeping that on while I cook and stuff. And now we're gonna go make some chili. It was very dark in here. All right, so let's see. Now I have, have some beef. If you wanna do, obviously you, you can use uh, turkey, ground turkey. I'm turning up. I'm gonna turn on, put on some olive oil. Um, just a little dollop of that. And then if you want to do vegan ground beef, you can do that too. So I'm gonna let that get hot. And then we're gonna chop up some onions. I have red beans. You're resting on beef broth. I'm probably gonna make some cornbread with it. Tomato paste and some diced tomatoes. And then I think I have a pepper. I do. Look at my little baby pepper from my garden. It's too tiny, <laughs> but I'm gonna use it. It's fine. It's just a little baby pepper. Okay, we'll do this one. And an onion and garlic. Onion. Chop up this little baby pepper. Might as well, ew. Maybe not. No, the pepper's fine. The seeds are not doing too hot, but. <laughs> oh, I should actually put this in. Okay, let me get this out. really flew. Okay, getting that beef going. I like to make it with turkey too. Okay, onion powder. I feel like I can do this from memory. Onion powder on the beef. A bunch of it. Garlic powder. Whoa. Never too much garlic, honestly. And then mix that up. And let that brown. In the meantime, I'm going to cut an onion with you, or a pepper, my little baby pepper. Can't wait to do my nails. I always feel like they look so off when they're not done. <laughs> Sometimes I accept them as they are and others I'm like, ah, let's make it interesting. Okay. So then onion. I just cut it like this so that I don't have to like, like so I can take off the skin. I do it as fast as humanly possible. My husband told me to wet the knife. Have you ever tried that? I don't know if that, if that works. 
It seemed to have worked because I remember I was about to cry and he's like, what your knife? That worked actually. Okay, I gotta work fast. But not too fast that we're being dangerous. Oh, I feel like I didn't get enough of the, yeah, there's like skin on this. Okay, now slice it up. Slice up a whole yellow onion. Whoa! What, Bill? <laughs> you scared me. Minnie. And the beef is browning. And we need it to be more spiced up. So we're gonna get some cumin. This is not good right there. That's not gonna help me. Oh, you know what I could use? I have everything but the elote. I bet that'd be good in it just to like season the meat. I think it's probably safe to say we can. Put that in. my Halloween plates. They're in my Dollar Tree haul. <laughs> I found that it's an appetizer plate, but I'm using it as a spoon rest. It's okay. This is my cauldron. See all the smoke? Ooh. The steam. Cooking is kind of like a potion. Like it's got all these ingredients and you're putting it all together to make a magical food to eat. Really just stabbing it. Okay. Um, okay, now the beef broth. Okay. Now that we're like translucent, the onions. Now we're gonna take our beef broth or chicken broth, whatever you really wanna use, or vegetable broth if you're making it vegan. to eyeball this I think like oh <clears throat> cup and a half I would say is pretty safe plus you're gonna let it sit all day so we have that beef broth in there then we're gonna put our drained yeah we're gonna drain these first drained kidney beans drained kidney beans in there Mix that up. Tomato paste. Okay, take you guys. We're here. We're a can opener. Dump that in. Nice tomatoes, scoop out some, mix that in first. Mix that up, that looks really good already. And scoop in a big scoop of tomato paste, or two. Like half a little container, that's what I usually do. Oh, you know what I think I should have done? Waited till it got hot. <laughs> And then add a tomato paste. It's okay. We'll mix it up later. And then salt and pepper, depending on how salty and peppery you like it. And then we're literally just gonna let this sit. There's nothing else to do. I like to add corn, but my husband doesn't like the corn, so I leave it out. We're just gonna get that up to boil. Once it boils, lower it down to simmer and let it sit all day until you're ready to eat it. That's where you get the flavor. We have leftover beef broth. So I'm gonna save this. All right, now I'm gonna go lay down. Okay. 
What haunted house are we looking at today? Okay, where to now? Probably to go into the nursery. All right, I just need to sit down. Oh, I'm tired. Okay. Okay, let's see. Looks like it's getting close to being done, but I'm just gonna let it sit until we're ready. It's only three right now. Wait till dinner time and it'll be even more delish. I think I'm just gonna take my little Lily. Where'd she go? There she is. For a walk, if you want to come. What does she see? Oh, Lily, what do you see? <laughs> hey, Bonzi, how are you doing? Okay, we're gonna make the cornbread now. What is this? This, I think it's super cheap at Walmart. <laughs> Sweet yellow cornbread muffin mix. Okay, we've already dipped into the cornbread, which is actually really good and super cheap. <laughs> another piece and then the chili was delish got our headless horseman always watching over we just ate dinner and I think I'm going to watch some American Horror Story Coven which I've already seen but I'm watch I like to rewatch it around the fall spooky season pretty sure my makeup's all over my face And um, then we'll probably watch Midnight Mass. Still haven't finished that. We're on episode three now. Um, really like it. What do you guys think? Have you seen it yet? Have you watched it? Because I am pretty into it. Um, kind of reminds me of like a Stephen King movie. Like I feel like he's definitely made something similar to that. Um, but still very good. Very into it. No, there's stuff all over my mouth. Oh my God. I eat like a child. So I think that is it for day one of Vlogtober 2021. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It means so much to me. And uh, if you are subscribed, please ring the little notification bell. And then you'll be notified when I upload a new video. And... We can all chat. You know, I love talking to you guys and hanging out. I always respond. If I don't respond, it's because YouTube didn't show me the comments. Sometimes they do that. I don't know why. But um, sometimes it will allow me access to the comment. No, no way. Um, but anyway, so thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.